Uh, shout out to uh, Daily. I see you there on uh, Instagram. Thanks for joining us. Uh, join in on the conversation. Join in on the conversation. Um, what do you guys think? Because I, I, I think one, the, I think something that that actually bothers me is is giving your giving your kid an identity before they know who they are. Yeah, that's a no no. You know, I think I think it's it's, it's, it's kind of like. You know, you have, and, and I understand. You know, you're you're a woman that's a single woman that's bringing up your kid by yourself, whatever. You know what I'm saying? And and uh, you know, maybe have a man around or whatever. But you, if you're a grown woman, you know what men, some things about men that do or whatever, where you let them know to distinguish a boy from a girl. You know, uh, and then let them grow up and learn who they are and who their identity is for themselves as opposed to pushing it onto them at a kid mm-hmm. because you see it as a trend of being okay right now. You know what I mean? I think that's, do you feel, you all understand what I'm saying? Well, so what you're saying is this. So women, and, and this is what I used to tell women a lot that were single parents raising boys. One, you're not a man. That's the first thing. As a mother, your job is to nurture. Your job is to train or teach them things, you know, especially um, helping them understand Um, what it is as far as them being an individual person and how to take care of themselves. Just in case something happened, you're not around. It's not necessarily that your family is going to want to take care of your children, Mm -hmm. you know, but it is not my job to be a man and trying to teach my sons how to be a man. Mm -hmm. This is where you get mentors for them. This is where you get the men in your family to step up and play a part in their life. This is where you Put them, you know, in church. Introduce it to them. Introduce yeah. that to who they are. Identify yeah. the exactly. male from a female part or whatever. But and- the problem with that is, Stephen, a lot of women that have these children and they the fathers are no longer there. They're so bitter behind the, the person that's not there that they tend to spew over in their emotions to their child, especially their men child.